Hello everybody and welcome to another Agile IT Tech Talk. I'm your host Sean Spicer and today we're going to look at how to create multi-tenant teams with Microsoft Edge web apps. Now in order to do this you're going to have to know how to do multiple personas using Microsoft Edge. I explained that in our last Tech Talk so if you're not aware of how to do that go and check out that previous video first. But let's go ahead and get started. Right now we're in Microsoft Edge and you can see up here that I have got my work persona for my mod admin demo environment. And to get started to create these multi-tenant teams, we're gonna to go to teams.microsoft.com. Now, if you're not signed in, it's gonna prompt you to sign in with a worker school account, as well as challenge you with your MFA or using Microsoft Authenticator. However, we're already signed in. Next, what you're gonna do is go up to settings and more, click the ellipses, go to apps, and install this site as an app. It's then going to prompt you to name the app. In this case, we're gonna call it Demo Teams and install. We can go ahead and close this and I'm gonna show you how to open that up straight from the taskbar. Now you can see here recently added Demo Teams, but it's a lot easier to just use the Cortana search, Demo Teams, and it's gonna open up that web app. Now that's great, you've got a browser version of Teams. What's the big hoopla? Well, what we're going to do now is we're going to switch over to my Agile IT account. And we're going to go to the same place. And I want to show you another trick here. It's going to challenge me with MFA because we're a little bit more secure. Don't worry, eventually our demo environment will be as secure as my Agile IT environment. Verify, stay signed in. Now the other nice thing about the Teams web app when you create them is that it works off the URL. So if you choose, you can go over to an existing team and channel in the sidebar after it loads. And in this case, let's go down to my happy little sandbox, general. And then we're gonna do the same thing. Click the ellipses, create apps, Install this site as a web app. It's going to ask us to name it. We're going to call it Agile Teams. We're going to go ahead and install. It's going to do that pop up again. So we've got it here. And the cool thing is, we also have the demo team right next to the Agile IT team without having to jump back and forth between the two tenants. So now we can easily work within multiple environments. Now, this affects me on a day-to-day -day basis because I do a lot of my work and collaboration, of course, in our Agile IT Teams environment, but I also have to do a lot of work with my Microsoft cohort in the Microsoft Teams environment. This really helps me out. So until the feature for multi-tenancy in Teams is available generally, this is a great workaround to allow you to work in multiple tenants and teams. This can also be helpful if you have to work between GCC high and normal commercial teams. So I hope this has been helpful. Thanks for watching and have a great day.